you can't tell me that it's synthetic unless I tell you. y'all welcome to my channel my name is Amani Alize if you're new here which you probably should be because this is my first video make sure you subscribe and leave a thumbs up for me if you like these type of videos I will be doing beauty hair like hair related fashion things like that on this channel here um, I do have a couples channel with my amazing boyfriend I'll leave the link down below please support that page as well but um, yeah, today I will be doing my first video on this channel and I will be reviewing this beautiful unit in my head here. She looks like a virgin or human hair unit, doesn't, doesn't she? But she's synthetic, girl. Yes, girl, she's synthetic. And her name is Seraphine and this is the one of the um, melted hairline wigs from Altre in their collection but yeah her name is Seraphine I did get her in a 1B I was looking for her for a 1 but I couldn't find it so I ordered this from Amazon but it was shipped from Sam's Beauty if that makes sense so the actual website Sam's Beauty but I guess they're partnered with Amazon or something but it I ordered it from Amazon but the box is Sam Beauty when I got it yeah she is gorgeous I just came here to review it I won't be installing it in this video I do have another video coming of me installing it and keep in mind this is my first time installing a wig I usually get my hairstylist just to put a wig on for me, but this is a synthetic unit, like I said, and I wanted to try it out myself. And I think I did pretty good for it to be my first time installing it. Cause girl, when when I had my first synthetic unit, I think I was coming out of high school. It didn't look like this. Okay, girl, it it looks synthetic. It sound it looked like what it sounds like. The name synthetic but this here they outdid their self so some of the specs of this wig it is hd lace is hd very hd it blends in so good it is beginner friendly to me just because like i said i don't usually put on wigs myself i usually get someone else to put them in for me but if i'm able to do it you're able to do it okay <laughs> and also it is big head friendly in my opinion because i have a huge dome girl okay I have a big head so it when I first put it on when you watch the install you'll see my face because it was kind of like a little tight but I pulled it a little bit more and it did still go from ear to ear sideburns everything like that that's what comes with this wig baby hairs included and they do look very natural I didn't do any baby hairs personally just because I feel like I like the look of it now you can do baby hairs and I might do some later but I'm still learning on how to do those myself as well. We have the edge booster here that I was going to use, but I just decided to leave it as is. It also comes with elastic band. So when I put this on, I put the elastic band on. There's three combs in here. There's one, two, and then three in the nape of your neck area. And I put all of those, I used all of those things before I even used any um got to be i used the yellow can and then i used the black i used the black for um the cap as well but before i even did any of that it was already kind of melting into my actual scalp so i was like she's gonna be fire and she is girl as beautiful as she is that she is you know there is a little bit that comes with it it does tangle now keep in mind it's synthetic so it's going to tangle um i feel like no matter what synthetic wig you're going to get that's what you get and she's pretty long i'm 4'11 on a good day i'm five feet but this is where it stops on me um so she's pretty long i don't know the actual inches but that was just a reference to you if y'all are around my height or if you're taller than me then you'll know it goes up and up you know the taller you are than the five feet that i am does tangle a little bit as well like little tangling here 
but that's something that I was expecting as well. So tangling and a little bit of shedding. I did get some shedding because I burned the hair with the hot comb, girl. Like, what? You can use heat on it. You can use heat. But it does say safe up to 400 degrees in that little corner right there. The hot comb I have, it only has an on and off button. So, I don't know. I think my hot comb go up to 500 and that's probably why it burnt a little bit. But, you know what? Don't even worry about all that because... That ain't the point. <laughs> so I think some of the shedding came from when the hot comb burnt the hair a little bit. And some curls did fall, which was fine with me. Because that's kind of what I wanted. Kind of like an early Kim K. I don't know if y'all see it, but I kind of see it. Like, you know. The early Kim K vibes. And we love a good Kim K curl, girl. I love it. It's not something I would wear every day just because it is a synthetic unit and I would want to get the most longevity as it out of it as I could. So I probably would just put it on a mannequin head or I would wrap it back in the netting that it came in and just put it like, you know, in this plastic seal. Um but yeah, you could wear it every day, I guess. You know, some people do. I they could take care of it better. I just don't cuz I like to throw my wigs on and yeah. <laughs> I usually wear a human hair wig so sometimes I will sleep in those or something like that most of the time but I'm not going to sleep in this this is coming off but I, d I have seen some girls who wrap their hair up so good in their synthetic wig and it just falls back down I ain't to that level yet okay like I said you know it's it's, it's just giving it's doing what it's supposed to right now all right y'all I don't remember exactly where I was at because my camera died and I had to wait for it to charge a little bit I really have to get a second battery pack, but it does, like I said, it does come with some shedding. Be careful if you are going to use like a hot comb or any type of hot device, hot tool um, to flatten the top, which I still need to flatten the top some more as well. But, you know, if you're going to use it, be careful. Don't do like me. Don't be too high up with the temperature. But like I said, mine doesn't come with a temperature. It was literally only on or off. So I have to invest in a better one, but yeah overall i love this hair i'll trade did their thing with this you know i mean it looked like i ordered this from an actual virgin hair company or a human hair company you know you can't tell me that it's synthetic unless i tell you and that's on per um yeah do i recommend this wig 100 percent? i give it about i give it like an I guess I'll give it a nine and a half out of ten just because of the shedding. But like I said, that's just something I feel like the shedding and tangle is just something that I feel like you're really not gonna get that too much away from from a synthetic wig. But yeah, so that's all I had to say about this beautiful Miss Seraphine. So if you're interested in these lashes, these are lashes are these lashes are a part of my brand. Um, I have the link down below to my website, um, All Things Alize. And a lot of people <laughs> thought Alize was like my last name. This is my middle name. Yeah, so All Things Alize will be listed down below. This is the Lash Style Baddie. Then, um, what else? Lip gloss is already off my lips. I've been talking for too much and doing too much stuff. But I do make my own lip gloss as well. And I also sell that. So that would be on the website down below too. Support the couple's channel with my boyfriend and I. The link would be down below in the description for that as well. If you love today's video, please leave a thumbs up. Comment down below. Comment some wigs that y'all want me to review. because. Just um, comment down below some things. I do have some more upcoming videos that I do want to film. Some wigs that I do have in mind. But yeah. Um, so hopefully you enjoyed today's video. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.